Welcome to Cloudberry Backup, a cross-platform backup solution for private and business needs. In this video, we will learn how to use Amazon S3 and Glacier Storage Services with Cloudberry Backup. First, create a free Amazon S3 account if you don't already have one. Press Create an AWS Account button to sign up. The free storage tier is 5 gig. Enter your email or phone number, then press Sign In to start the registration. During the registration, Amazon will also verify your phone number and credit card information. After you complete the registration, sign in to the new account using I'm a returning user option. Find S3 in the AWS console products list. To connect S3 with Cloudberry Backup, you need to specify the access keys. Go to the account options and select security credentials option. Now, open the Access Keys tab and press on the Create New Access button to get the key. It is time to add the S3 account to the Cloudberry Backup. Click on the Main Menu button, select Add Account, and choose S3 Storage Type. Here, you can set the account name and specify access keys from the S3 console. In the same window, you can create an S3 bucket using the drop-down menu. To configure Amazon Glacier account, choose Glacier as an account type and specify the same access keys. You can create Glacier Vault via this account setup window or using AWS Control Panel. Now you can use Amazon S3 and Glacier to store backups. Let's create a backup plan using the new S3 account. As an example, choose a folder for backup on the source disk and use default options in simple mode. Specify a schedule if you want and review the settings on the last screen. The backup plan is ready. Now you know how to start using Amazon S3 and Glacier for backup. Try the solution for free with Cloudberry Backup's 15-day trial. Visit our website to find out more. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. That's it, and thanks for watching.